What's up Guardians, I'm Cornholio and in today's Destiny video, we're going to talk about the upcoming season of Opulence. Today on May 28th, 2019, Bungie revealed a lot of information about the upcoming season of Opulence. With that information, we got a brand new trailer. And if you haven't watched that trailer just yet, stick around because we're going to watch it right now. A new mystery awaits you, Guardian. Welcome to the season of opulence. What will you find in the Emperor's lost vaults? Treasure hunts will lead you to powerful weapons and armor. These will quickly boost your power level and prepare you for the menagerie. This season's all new six player match made activity. Grow strong, Guardian. Prove your worth. And that was the trailer reveal for Season of Opulence. In addition to the trailer, we also got a brand new website that was put up by Bungie earlier today. This is the website here for the upcoming Season of Opulence, and we can see the first thing being featured is Menagerie, the brand new six-person activity. And here's what Bungie has to say about this. Assembling your Chalice of Opulence is just the first step. Callus has crafted a maze of challenges in his Lost Vault. Test your strength in this all-new six-player match-made activity, the Menagerie, and meet the challenge head-on to unlock your reward. And we can see here we will be getting Leviathan Secrets, where we confront new challenges on the unexplored deck of Kallus' massive ship. In addition, treasures await. Upgrade the Chalice of Opulence to better refine which gear to earn. And finally, we have replayability. Carve your way through ever-changing paths and enemies in this new Menagerie six person activity we also know that we'll be getting the upcoming crown of sorrows raid that will be coming on june 4th bungie states that you seek out the most valuable treasures in the underbelly of the leviathan jump into the new crown of sorrows raid and join the chase for world's first on day one we can see that we'll be getting new weapons and armor. Annual pass content in Season of Opulence provides a new path to earn some of the best gear in the game. Use the Chalice of Opulence to choose which type of gear you earn from each menagerie. Unravel the mystery and unlock its power to build a loadout that matches your playstyle. We can see here we get a number of weapons including a sniper rifle, a sword, we're going to get a hand cannon, fusion rifle, different types of armor, a hand cannon, and rocket launcher. So it looks like we're getting quite a bit of new stuff here with the new update. In addition to that, we'll be getting gameplay updates. There will be an update to the Power Surge. Forsaken owners can heed Callus's call to quickly catch up to the power of their fellow guardians with the new Power Surge quest. In addition, Iron Banner returns. Destiny 2 owners should return to Lord Saladin and discover how they can forge a new path to new rewards, including a new Iron Banner questline. In addition to that, exotic weapons and armor will be returning. Annual Pass owners can add more of the best weapons to their collection. And for those 
of the Guardians who are bravest and chase after their pinnacle weapons, you have something to chase this season as well. In the form of pinnacle gear, every player of Destiny 2 will find their rank reset in the Crucible, Gambit, and Vanguard missions. At higher ranks, Guardians will find rewards that double as both weapons and trophies. Earn the right to carry evidence of your power into battle. First up, we have the Revoker, which is a Crucible Pinnacle weapon with a special perk where missed shots are returned to the magazine after a short duration. Next up, we have the Wendigo GL3, where Orbs of Light increases blast radius and damage. And this is the pinnacle weapon that you get for Vanguard. And lastly, we have for pinnacle gambit weapons, we have the Hush, which gives you hip-fired precision shots with massive draw speed bonus. In addition to pinnacle weapons, we will have the Solstice of Heroes returning later this summer. The Solstice of Heroes is a tradition in which Guardians reflect on past hardships and celebrate their resilience of humanity for foremost defenders. Celebrate with other Guardians in this limited time event. You'll get a chance to pursue Solstice Armors. Seek out Eve Levante in the Tower to begin your pursuit of Year 2 Solstice Armors. Embrace the Light. Create Elemental Orbs by matching your Elemental Damage to the Daily Element. Collect 30 Orbs to gain the Empowerment Buff. And finally, you'll get a chance to be Triumphant. Harness the power of the elements to optimize your pursuits of glory and loot while Moments of Triumph is active. So there we have it. We have so much to be excited about with the upcoming Season of Opulence, including the Menagerie, which will be the all-new six-person match-made activity. We'll get the all-new Crown of Sorrows raid, which will be the thing we'll be playing on day one to chase after the world's first title. In addition, we can look forward to brand new weapons and armor, gameplay updates, brand new pinnacle weapons, solstice of heroes, and so much more. If you like this video, hit that like and subscribe and comment down below what you're most excited about with the new season of opulence. Thank you for watching this video, Guardians, and we'll see you in the next one.